But then you also have a, a lion bounty hunter. See. Night Stalker's been winning also. I want to say the vast majority of the game here is oh. in a lot of trouble here. Puppy with the body block. I mean, he's surely dead unless Black can do something amazing to save his life. S4 tries to go for the slow. It's not going to work. Yapstor claims first blood. Start for secret. That's what they need. So they can take those fights and... Quite the cute little plays with the cancel TP. Bottom lane again, S4. He's Jeez, done. Gonna have a really rough one down here. All right, S4, we need to talk. It's the second time he's down. Oh boy. You get a bit more aggressive and... I mean, at least with the mana low, he takes a little less damage from the AM. Yeah. But uh, it's it's just constant zoning. <laughs> nice to find him. It's not that bad. Yeah, he's got the brother. Oh, the glimpse onto Fada. Can they close the distance to the open wounds? They can. Fada is looking very dead here, and S4 is fine bottom. Look at Fada's positioning here in the mid lane. He's trying to go for Noto. Noto in some trouble here, getting run down by the spin. And with Yapsor there, they just give it to mid one. They don't even need to help him. I was going to say, they didn't even need the other two there. Mid one's going to be like, what are you doing stealing my XP, boys? <laughs> he had that one solo all along. And it gets scary to watch mid one hits the six. It's just a good lane for Look at, I mean, Fada's just bottom now. He's just like, yeah, top lane's uh, impossible versus life stealer. He's just, if he gets glimpsed at any point versus uh, versus Nikes in the lane, he's just dead. Yeah. Four now. Trying to jungle. Just surrounding him, too. This is some nice moving coming up. He, he is gonzo. Absolutely. Uh, going for that camp. I think he saw Fada was there, right, didn't he? I don't Did think he... He, he didn't know that Yapso was there in Viz, though. Okay, so. okay, fair enough. Mid one's on his way over there. Level 5, doesn't have the Omni Slash just yet, but Puppy Radiant's trying to get tower. in front of him to get the body box. Well, with the Orb of Venom, Glimpse comes out, and mid one. The gap, there's no boots on this disruptor. Should be able to get this kill here. Just and meanwhile. The and no tells, just managed to find Yap still, but it's. One getting the Stellar Kills. Like mid one had hit, still took it back to that. Oh! Uh, that will give him the level 6. He knows he needs to bring Reza down a bit with Puppy and an Omni Slash. Mid one can turn around. And they Infest this oh. the crit is out. Mid one gets the double kill. No tail does turn up and is able to switch around the glory though. OG. First down the jug. Didn't queued up as well, so rushing for that battle fury as expected. This time he does have the boost. So last time he did get the mid lane. Oh, the little round no round tail. Puppy as well. Enough slow and difficult to bring him down with the blade fury. No tail is gone. This is a problem for OG. They can't be getting they can't be hemorrhaging this many kills this early on. Fada? Spot above her, but he will get up the ground. They haven't quite got vision for the control. They get the void. Moving in, diving deep, and they will claim it. Just a double edge out. Puppy tries to come in, but in fact, he's not got mana for Infants. They just kill him as well. OG take a couple. Nicely done. There you go. Not quite sure what the plan was there from Puppers. Yes, but it, at this point in time, it is OG just dying a lot just by getting ran at. Five fly. We'll take the bounty. Top right now, yeah, so it does get picked up, but the neutral clap actually denies to the kill from OG. Oh, now. mid one's gonna get Jarex by Luke. He's being returned. But mid one's gonna go down here. Good. Oh, no. Is he? He even buys the extra calling blade on top of the battle. Oh, wow. Efficiency to the max. Just straight farming. He knows he doesn't need to fight. His teammates are gonna try to make the space for him until he gets that man to Oh, battle. mid one's got on these last straight onto Jarex. Bam! Mid one. I mean, he eight is and two. so uh, eight and two. Eight, is that, yes, is eight that kills. Real? Eight kills on this mid jump. And oh, top no. lane, secret. They're okay, just only going to go and find another. The finger from Yapsor to bring resolution to his demise. All right, they're secret. They've got Ace in the mid lane. They've got Fada in the top lane. Resolution. He's just going for a bit of cross country walking across the map. It's he's fallen behind. They'll look for Puppy. They need to get kills out of this. OG are putting so much pressure on this bottom lane. They have to find something out of it. Can they actually do so? Everyone's already got the healing ward out. They'll get the static storm through. Stampede's pop. Puppy gets back to safety. But they have trapped mid one. They get the big jug kill. They do get Yapsor as well. And suddenly, the time and patience from OG on this bottom lane pays off. They get two kills, one of them being a big one. And they'll get the tier one tower as well. That's, the, as I said, no tails prior to I was going to say, I don't think I've ever seen him play it. He's played it, what, back in 2013. That was, that was before I was even born. That was a long time ago. He lost an RV with it, but he did beat EG. So no tails tinker over NA, as the stats would say. Rezo here, they've got the stun. The silence comes out. There's no finger from Yap, so they don't have the extra burst damage for him. Rezo's yeah, pulling very low. His mid one chases him with the playthrough. It might just be enough. One more hit will do it. This is a double kill from mid one. 
Can they bring him down and return? He has the healing ward out. Nice by quick, keep it away from Jerex. Jerex does still get the silence through. He's chased him down. Butter's there as well. They'll turn towards Jerax. Mip one and Fada both relatively low, but Mip one he has the play through. Back up. He's trying to man up against this. Butter comes in with a two man who's stop. Triple kill for Mip one. He's taken down a third, but he will go down and return. No tail. Gets the kill with a rocket. They do see him farming the lane. They have darkness as well. They want to pop him. They've they got these two combo. Yeah, they can. Oh, they can. Yeah, they with that sort of opening, they can have a chance. But Fada comes in with a who stop. Does that buy enough time? It does. Ace. No, oh, the glimpse. Fly! Saving the day for OG gets them that big old kill. They get Yapthor as well. Some PogChamp plays from Fly there. Look at his itemization too. He's going straight for a hex. Oh, that is dirty. They have, like we said, they've no real lock. They only have the two times <laughs> for that AM. Oh, Fly. Oh, boy. But a quick slap from s Jumps him down. s popping the Primal Split. They're going to turn towards Fada. They have the upper with Fada. Look for the TP out with the boulder flying in the way of his face. Done. The horseman gets crushed down, and they're trying to see if they can get more puppets. Already out of there with the invis. Mid one's going to turn up to the fight. He's got the manta. You take the tower, OG. Right. This is a hard kill that the joke. If he gets that blade fury off, oh, he's in trouble. He does get it off. He's got manta. He's going to remove that quick silence from the next stalker. Too slippery. Maybe so it's grave. Oh, I thought you were saying it was the death. Okay, it wasn't the death. No, the death was already out. Puppy, Puppy. though. Hey, hey, hey. hey. No tail. He's ready. He buys dust. This is a prepared man. And nice. it pays oh, no. off. No tail. No tail's doing very well this game. After the laning phase, which looked Look a little bit that. a little bit questionable because he got killed once or twice by the jug. Cause buying dust in 27. And Ace That's gets caught out here. There's an infest coming out too. They're going to kill me easily. Oh, gee. With me. Very crisp movement around the map. This is a really nice tinker performance. We said we haven't seen it much, but he's coming into this game, and if he continues to play like this, it's going to throw a huge spanner in the world's first secret. His farm is pretty much on par with this AM that got a battle fury 11 minutes in. Now Mid Potter. lane, no selling Jarek are there. They pick off the Centaur War Runner. Because the game is not going to get fun to play for the split pushing AM once that hex is on. I, I mean, with the hex, can you still. Chain burst down at this stage with the mana pool on one trip out from the base. Do you think Nota on his own? He can't do it by himself. No. He can't do it by himself. No, I am still, still not a duck down. Yeah, they need they need some help to be able to do that. But it is an insane. Yes. It does. And of course they've got Raven. It's very easy to pick him up across the map, take him back to base, and take him out to the AM. Yep. With Infest, they can even yep. just infest the Tinker, and he can be that yeah, it's really that nice. ganker. And you can always, you know, bots on top of the Brewmaster split, which is a really nice little combo that they can do. We'll probably won't see it too much in this game, but it is an option. Dire Fury gets taken out. Ace. Has to be careful. Oh, here he's going to get glimpsed. He's he is great in. That's a beautiful catch from OG. Manta, indeed, as yeah. you said earlier, it ain't going to save you from Static Storm. No doubt. You see your AMD four. The Hex to find can't get away, but up top. Until that point in time, Ace is going to get jumped. Silenced up, shot stuck in the tree line. OG do it again. They're catching Ace out. He used Manta to farm and push the wave out, so didn't have it to remove that. Oh, okay. He probably would have been picked off anyway from that night vision, plus yeah. the glimpse that would have came out with Static Storm, but... He's got to be careful with that Manta. He can't use it aggressively, especially with that. Like, yeah. So many things that... He has to be worried off when OG moving around like this. Yeah, OG not. He's still static stone from every room after split and this tier three. There's no glyph for another 15 seconds or so. This tier three should go down here. Yeah, down, the rack's exposed, but it jumps in, instant rage from Rezo, looks towards Yapsu, Yapsu falls back, but the glitch is there from Fly, the Hex is down at the bottom, they have got enough damage to quite kill Fada straight away. Arcane Root, And here comes the push, 26 minutes in, the rack's exposed on the bottom lane, secret down, two members. Ace, of course, no intention of popping a buyback at this stage, he has to keep his gold good for any chance of this game, and secret, just have to let this one go on the bottom. Melee racks fall, the range racks will stay up as the creep wave has been taken out. Nothing because of OG rotation he's finding him oh Reza gets forced up but he kind of says thanks for that one Fada pops the stampede they were trying to catch Rezo out there with that play mid one and groups into the center of the all with the play here secret trying to get their team stuck in but in the high ground s there with the promise but holding back ace. the rest of secret so ace again he's getting caught out time and time again i don't know what's going on secret they're just falling apart, and OG, they're sticking their teeth in. There's mass buybacks coming out from Secret. Mip one leads forward. Three buybacks coming out from the side of Secret. They have to get some men out of this, but I don't think they're going to get anything at all. OG just walk away out of the base. 9k gold lead just coming out of 
Thin Hair and No Tails back in. Jumps in with the Hex. They force back mid one. They do get the stun on their four. But OG, this this might just even be game over. Secret are absolutely crumbling. The huge mana void. Mana void though from Ace says, Shut up, Pony Pixel. I'm going to turn this game around. Two kills for Secret. Yap still gets the finger. They find the third. They look towards Fly. Mid one moves forward. He's stuck in the connect field. But mid lane, the bigger kill is look looked upon. They're trying to get resolution. They're chasing him down. Still has ears too. Can they, they may be able to kill him twice. There's three members down on OG. They're still trying to chase. Mid one will finish off Fly. They've got resolution. They'll bring him down once. Everyone down on OG. They'll look to take him a second time. Instant Hex is there from Yapsor. The man has gone for Rezo. It's a full team wipe. Those fights. Radiance top tower is under attack. But it's step. I don't know which way this game's gonna go. There's an incredibly fat jug and AM on the side of Secret, but there's also an incredibly fat Tinker and Lifestealer over the side of OG. They still have, the thing is that OG has that overglaring team fight. Brewmaster plus Disruptor and Tinker gives you a lot more team fight too. That's the big difference here. Fod has been struggling to get in. I mean, he's 7,500 net worth on this Centaur when they have a track lineup. They haven't been able to get the, as many kills as I would think that they want to, but it's still very close, very back and forth. Thing. It's a lot about the vision fight in here. Oh, there we go. They do jump in straight away. Ace pops the BKB. Turns towards Fly. Gets one. Snappy's off by Faro. They look to chase down No Tail. He's then up into the air. They surround him. He gets the bleak off. More No Tail with the sick jukes. Gotta keep continue running. to chase. Can they defend Check out Fly. Needs to help him out. Again. The Yules gets himself out. I tell you what, this Yules perch with No Tail has been absolutely brilliant. The glimpse is there on Tail. He's taken back, but oh! Mid one jumps in with the Omni Slash, gets the kill on No Tail, turns back towards Fly. Disruptor will fall, Rezo. Looking towards Mid one, but Mid one's got the healing ward. He's going to try and man up with the break on Life Stealer, bringing him down to half health. Ace being healed up by the healing ward, jumps away from Rezo. Mid one continues to chase down this Life Stealer. Can they finish him off? They force him forward. He jumps in. Triple kill for Mid one. One. The track gold there is going to add up for sure, too. That's like a 4K swing already. They do actually have some value. Yeah. Secret will take a fight around this pit. They have Stampede. Oh, oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Spaghetti up. Oh. He's not killing it fast enough. Bada is smoked up. He's going to be able to get the jump. It seems like he's about to swing in. He's the time. He jumps in. He's just going to go past the pit. Rezo stays back on Rose, but Ace picks up a part on the sidelines. Jarek gets himself across. Rose is still alive. Who's going to get it? Secret are in. But OG get the kill. Rezo picks up the Aegis. Can OG still fight up against this? So Rezo's low on mana. The Master Style Illusions whittling it down. Mid one does pick off the sideline kill onto No Tail. Rezo turns, takes down Yapsor, but the chase is continuing. Puppy looking for him. S falls back out of the primal split. Fada holds him back with the Who Stomp. Puppy turning towards him. Mid one's there as well, offering the damage required to bring down this brew. He's got a bit of evasion from the passive, but it's not enough to save him. OG lose four. Rezo still trying to desperately take this Aegis back to base and safety. But who's chasing him? It's Ace. He cleans up the two kills in the pit. He turns up to the top, gets the Aegis out of the hands of Rezo. Everyone's dead on OG. No tail flying back. But the instant stones there onto Rezo. Rezo is down. Holy crap, Secret actually is looking like they've got this game. It's 12k gold lead now. That massive advantage. I mean, the double stun by Fada there yeah. was perfect That's on the two supports. Fantastic mana voids from Ace. Yeah. Fada after, I mean, he heard me. He's like, what? The perfect stun by hey. Ace. No-Tail jumping forward, Flyback will come out from Rezo, but Fada and D go straight away onto No-Tail, No-Tail falls back, Ace trying to jump forward with the BKB, turns towards Rezo, but Rezo already pops the Rage, eats down Fada, that's the Centaur gone, Secret have to back out with one man down, the Chain Hex is out, they've got the control, Rezo's allowed to rip into this Bounty Hunter, get the Puppy Kill, the rest of Secret have to back off, can OG get any sort of catch? Links away there from Mib1. Fire Jug complete. Just jumps in into S4, gets hexed up, or onto the high ground. Oh, no turn, look towards Ace. Let's get low. Very hard to catch. Let's go jump forward, looking for Puffy. Do have the vision, Puffy's good fall. Let's put the stampede, Fada jumps in, gets the two man who's the but Ace comes in as well. The static storms down, but they've lost no tail. The secret, they've got the big kill. And they get more. Rezo turns towards Fada, jumps him out, but a secret. They're getting the favorable numbers. They're taken down too. The hex is stunned from Yapsor, perfectly controlling resolution. He's been nullified as well. And this That's is looking point. pretty grim indeed for OG. There's no buybacks on Rezo, none on no tail. S4 getting hexed up, enjoying that plus five Omni Slash from, our, from mid one. Ace is always there every time behind him, making yeah. sure they can capitalize on the perfect angle with the cleave damage that Fada sets up with that. Yeah. No tail needs BKB. 
He's a very long ways away. I now believe the game may just be over. Jax yeah, is getting caught down. outside of the base. There's still 30 seconds. No, no tail. 45, no life. Dylan Ace knows it. He's straight on the base. Onto those tier fours. Looking to finish the game off. Pretty sure the GG will come out very shortly. As OG, they've got no way to hold this defense. There's no one on the playing field. Oh, they're not even firing back. He buys a meteor hammer. He just buys to end the it. meteor hammer. Yeah, sure. Ladies and gentlemen, it's securing an incredibly high win rate for that item in professional gaming. So the Reddit thinks it's good. And this is the entry point. GG is called Team Secret. Take the win. But what an entertaining back and forth game indeed. And I can't wait for game two. We did say it would be hard for the Tinker, especially when you have AM farming. They did a really good job of catching him over and over again, though. They caught him four times in a row after he got Battle Fury and Manta, just going around making those moves.